is your first alert five weather with Alex O'Brien. Good morning and welcome back. We're in for a chilly start this morning. Certainly nothing we can't handle. Outside right now across the Pikes Peak region, it's 29 in Manitou, 24 Air Force Academy, 28 in Monument, 25 Colorado Springs proper. It's 22 in Woodland Park and 24 Fort Carson. Across the rest of Southern Colorado, we're mostly starting in the 20s and 30s today. Some teens out there, like in Lamar at 16, gets colder in that Arkansas River Valley. But those Temperatures won't be staying this cold for very long. We'll warm up very nicely today and the next two days will be the warmest of this week. Lots of sunshine today at to a high of 57, so it might feel just as warm today as tomorrow. Even though our technical temperature will be warmer on Saturday, we will have more clouds in the sky, so that's something that you can watch out for. But after that, we've got more of an active pattern setting up late Sunday night into Monday morning. I will note this storm looks relatively weak. Notice temperatures don't drop too much from it, and we do have a chance for some late snow showers Sunday evening into Monday morning. I wouldn't put much merit in it for really impacting your Monday morning commute, but we could pick up an inch or two here in Colorado Springs. Temperatures through the rest of next week will start to rise. We'll have lots of sunshine and a drier pattern overall. So really a dry and relatively mild seven day forecast for Pueblo 60s today, tomorrow and on Sunday. Later in the evening, that's when we have a few snow showers possible, but looks pretty dry for Pueblo starting next week. Just a little cooler and maybe a morning flurry after that we're dry. Canyon City 60 today, 63 tomorrow, increasing clouds through the weekend, but it should be really nice in general. A light snow shower possible Sunday night. I think that will clear out pretty quickly by Monday morning. And then we're back to the 50s in no time by later next week. Woodland Park, we have an impact too for this next system coming in Sunday night. So you could pick up a couple inches from this. It's trending a little weak though. So notice we reach a high above freezing on Monday. So things should melt pretty quickly after that. 